forgiveness is the most important and most powerful thing that you can do for your physiology and your spirituality yet it remains one of the least attractive things to us largely because our egos rule so unequivocally what's up everyone welcome back if you're new here i am aditya mulkuri the host of tats podcast the great feature for your bright future and today in this episode i would like to explain you what is the purpose of forgiveness to forgive is somehow associated with saying that it is all right that we accept the evil deed but this is not a forgiveness number 1 forgiveness is gift you give to yourself my angel you said it's one of the greatest gift you can give yourself to forgive forgive everybody mind might try to convince you the forgiveness is letting something someone off the hook and that you are in the fact doing those who mistreated you as a favor by forgiving them but the truth of the matter is that you are doing yourself a favor forgiveness is a gift you give to yourself to be at peace to be happy and to be able to sleep at night you are not doing this for them you are doing it for yourself to set yourself free from yourself and from the feeling of hurt anger helplessness that keep both of you attached for some long and to be at peace number 2 Forgiveness is an act of strength. Contrary to what you have been led to believe, forgiveness is an act of strength. You don't forgive because you are weak, but because you are strong and have to realize that only by letting go of resentments you will be happy and at peace. The weak can never forgive. Forgiveness is the attribute to strong. Number 3. Forgiveness is a sign of self-love. we must develop and ha- ma- maintain and habit the capacity to forgive he who is devoid of the power to forgive forgive is devoid of the power to love there is some good in the worst of us and some evil in the best of us when we discover this we are less prone to hate our enemies love yourself together and love yourself and not to let go of all the toxicity from your life and free yourself from all the anger bitterness and resentments If you're mad, be mad. Don't hide and suppress your feelings. Let it all out. But once you're done with being mad, allow forgiveness to enter your heart. Let go and love. Number 4. When you forgive, you find peace. If you let go a little, you will have a little peace. If you let go a lot, you will have a lot of peace. If you let go completely, you will have complete peace. Peace of mind is what you find the moment you let go of any grudges and resentments you might be holding on to the moment you say to yourself it is time to let go it is time to forgive that will be the moment you will find peace in life we get that what we give and we reap what we sow and since we are humans and we all make mistakes that more we forgive others for past present and future mistakes the more others will forgive us when we will make mistakes forgive and you will be forgiven so this is today's episode hope i can get some value added content for you thank you for listening i am aditya mulukuri the host of tats podcast signing off peace